Hello and welcome to Team WP's Fledgling Fighters EX number 180. Alright. A tournament for beginners and intermediate players in Oz New Zealand, which to clarify is for those under Ultra Platinum. I'm Jazza and I'm joined by Felscribe and Pitsy. Yo. How are you Hello. guys? I'm well, thanks, Jezza. How are you? Yeah, good. Good, good. Looking forward to another exciting night of Fledgling's action. Big bracket. Yeah, it's a giant bracket of 28 people tonight. And up first, we have... Uh, Danish Koo and Jimsy. Uh, there will be a slight delay. Jimsy's PC has just crashed, so we'll wait for... <laughs> oh, oh, wait. Of course. <laughs> It, it then, wouldn't uh, be a fledglings without some sort of technical difficulties at the start. Uh, well, at least it's even-handed. Sometimes it's us, sometimes it's CFN. Like you, you know, and at least other it's times fair. it's Elstra. <laughs> it's always CFN Telstra. Things. I'm not even on Telstra. It's Telstra's fault. Just trust. Yeah, it, Telstra owns them all anyway. Yeah. All right. So. I assume he'll let us know in Discord when he's able to be invited. Yeah. Uh, watching that like a hawk, don't worry about that. Um, then afterwards, after this one, we'll have uh, Craftmaster and Alter Cyber. That should be a nice one. That should be um, an interesting match. And then a new face and a returning face after that. With uh, Vakamoz, which I don't recall. Yeah, that's a new name. Um, and Balake is back. In black. Uh, Alrighty. So, that's going to be interesting to see how, uh, how the rust is. Yeah, it's been a while for him, I think. I haven't seen him around the traps for a long time. I think he's had some prior commitments, but he's back and, from what I read last night, hungry to get some games in. Just what you want. Yeah, I was going to give him some before uh, before Tawny, but I completely forgot. Classic fell. At least I didn't fall asleep. That's true. I mean, <laughs> you haven't got the ultimate sleeping fell with Manat anywhere near you, so that's... Oh, there you go. That's it. It's all good. Alright, so is Jimsy online yet? Uh, I'll send him another invite. And his, uh, C his CFN is just the same? Yeah. Uh, so depending on how that goes, might have to kick that one back. We'll give him like another minute. What is it with these people on there? Hard, hard to spell. I always do the H. I did H before the E, like every time. Yeah. I... <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> yeah, I, I did the exact same thing. <laughs> Classic. Oh, I got Discord notifications. Uh, invite me, alright. Looking for an invite. There we go. In invite has been sent. Alright, cool. Let's get the show what? on the road. What you love to see. Dan and Dan, I think that's what we're going with. Yep. yep, definitely gonna be the Dan. Yep. Show no fight to start with. I don't recall yeah, seeing either of these two players beforehand. Uh, so you like fight together, I mean? Yeah. I don't think they've had a head to head match. So it, yeah. it'll be interesting. Uh, I'm expecting some, some Dan bullying. You know, when I first started playing and watching Street Fighter, I didn't like. Shoto, Shoto matches. 
But as time has gone on, it's just... It's grown on me. Just like... <laughs> Well, I also think the shoulders have evolved a little bit, right? Like, Ryu was kind of boring before, he's a little bit better now. I think Ken's actually really good these days, so they've all kind yeah. of come into their own a bit too. Fun to watch and actually just really good to play. Alrighty, so... Taking it rather slow at the start. Mm. is rocking the purple too, not his normal black colour. Yeah, I'm liking the purple as well. Mm. Gypsy stole his uniform and is starting to steal this round. Yes. Oop. Them Dan kick that that Dan kicks pressure. Dan's got some crazy pressure if you have to push the right buttons. Yeah. yeah. You, you you freeze for a second against those Dan kicks and Dan can get away with a lot of shenanigans. You see how sick that conversion was? That was like max range. <laughs> Oh, unfortunate time on that throw for Danish, but do not jump at this man. The XDP Ooh. takes it. Round two. Point. Plus. I think that's only plus on. Yeah, he charged it. Right? Did he charge it? Yeah. 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 Oh, push the button there. Cheeky dash. Damn pressure. Catches the jump or something. Oh, catches the <laughs> What is this sequence? That was sick! <laughs> I've never seen those sequences What? Before. Yeah, it's not just the dead, the dead kicks you have to be worried about. With that V skill too, just like, my god. Everything just feels like I'm just genuine... making my own strings out here. <laughs> yeah. The most open world of, of uh, characters. Oh, and that will be game one for Danish. So you know how... Um... Semi un semi unrelated, but you know how uh, Strive was meant to put that like combo creator trial thing in. Yeah. I think Capcom beat him to it, and they just put it in Dan. Yeah. Just really the most open world block strings. Just as long as you don't fuck it up and get crushed. Yeah. <laughs> what, 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 there was a lot of heavies there. What, what can what can Jimsy do here? Ooh, that is. Yolo and DP. <laughs> <laughs> I think maybe maybe some maybe some V reversal, right? We don't have to take all that pressure. He had a full full um yes. V bar as well. If you had a full V bar, you could V shift the uh, kicks and that'll blow it right up. Yeah. Problem was he was in the corner and like if that V shift didn't play out as well, like that would have been a punish. Uh, you should be able or to pretend, or react to at least read the kicks. Couple of throws after throws after throws into the corner. Spell A. Oh no, it's got a punch. Nice conversion. Right? Yeah, very good. Oh. I think if he activated it and did like light tatsu DP, he could have killed. Yep, yeah, potentially. I probably didn't even need to activate. Like maybe just a CA would have killed the. Oh, there we go. But the Ken <laughs> <Yes>, Classic. <laughs> <laughs> But you overstepping, so you eat these fists of fire. I don't know when to push a the button. Trade right? after I don't the even know when to push buttons there. <laughs> it's very difficult. Yeah. I... Oh, unfortunate heavy card, sir. Ooh, Dan kicks it into the heavy kick. It's like he's uh her box have pulled back enough so it whiffed. Hmm, yeah, that was that was a little bizarre. 
spinning it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> least, it must work on some level because he, he's done it twice and it's sort of worked. Yeah. Well. Alright, well, Danish on set point. And sure they have a lot, of, uh, a lot of control in the, uh, in the set. Trade. The YOLO EX Dan kicks, which is good. Sponsored by Naki. Oh, Ooh, nice base shift. Doesn't get to the break. Fortunately, puts himself in the corner. This is where I think a V-reversal would help, just get some space back. Well, okay. one six, there we go. Gonna spend it? Nope. Nice bit of damage, that is the entire V-trigger though. So... Uh, He's dead. He yeah, that's dead. 15 million years to confirm that into super. <laughs> yeah, you do. And Thanks. yet, I've... 15 million years to confirm that, and yet I've still seen Dan's fuck it up online. <laughs> Dan. uh, that was a very impressive showing there. That's some, that's some Dan tech I haven't seen before. If nothing else, I respect Jim C's ability to block for that long, because I know <laughs> if it had been me, that light, that crouch light kick would have been pressed several times. Or just EXDP through it, <laughs> one or the other. You know, yeah. we've been mashing that parry. <laughs> <laughs> the, the worst thing about Chun's three frame being the crouch light kick is if you're desperately mashing it, you ac get those accidental light lightning legs, and oh boy. I oh, that's a free three frame. Yeah, it oh, used to it used to be crouch light punch in season one, which was good because it led into our BNB, but. They, Changed the crouch light kick and of Craftmaster and um, uh, Chai in next, I think was it? So just they're the two I invited. No, it's also. Oh, it's also. Also. Alright, sorry, Joe. I have to get rid of you when you come in here. Uh, where's Ulta? Which which accounts Ulta using these days? Uh, I, I think it's I've just the normal it. one, so I right, just I've... invited that one. Yeah, yeah I got, got him. Oh, cool. if uh. Douglas shows up here, I'll just boot him. <laughs> yeah, it, it was good having Chun's pre frame being the light punch because the BNB just meant that you can wake up Button into better damage, but with, a, with it being on the light kick, your reward for mashing on wake up is significantly less. Yeah, but it's three frame low though. Like, no one's got that. I mean, it would still be a free frame blow on the light punch. No, you can stand block crash and light punch, can't you? Yeah, yeah, you can't. You just can't stand block the kicks. Light That's punch, you can stand block. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Hmm. I mean, I, 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 I think I'd, I'd rather have the the blocked crouched light punch. Can someone, into someone, me. someone boot Douglas. I didn't mean to invite him. Oh yeah. Um. Yeah, he's gone. Sorry, mate. Like, yeah, I, I'd, I'd rather have the free frame light punch as opposed to the low free frame. Really? Better, yeah, be better damage. Just yeah, if you can't convert off the, the, the crouching light um, kick, then yeah, I mean crouching light punch. You can for a lot of the characters I use, you could do big big conversion just off that off the three frame. Like, yeah, the, the crouching light punch led into. Oaky uh, medium bird kick, so yeah, yeah, much better than. I invited Alter again. I don't know what he's doing. Is he around? There, there, we go. there he is. Is. All right, here we go. It's go time. Oh, and see another Ken. I think uh, Alter's back using Ken, right? He sort of changes a bit. Who, who, who knows with Alter? He... <laughs> I don't think he ever stopped playing Ken. Yeah, I think Ken still is. Uh, I, I think he plays a lot of characters just to learn, but when need be, he always defaults back to the Ken. Yeah, yeah. But I don't know. It's been a long, long time since I played Alt. So who, who knows what's happened?
unless he's busted out like a a year in or something, I feel like he'd be foolish to drop Ken at this point. Because Ken's strong now. Ken's great. Uh, I think Ken's probably the strongest shadow in my opinion. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I can say that, but. But. Alright, so I'm totally wrong. <laughs> I've got a poison versus Kira, okay. This I'm interested. Interested to see, and well, Akira, Akira does struggle a bit against zoners, so let's see where this goes. Also, super gold for Alto. That... How how recent is that? That's been there for a while, I'm pretty sure. Because oh. Alto is also using different accounts, I think. So this is back to his main one. Um, so I think he's got super gold a while ago, but his alternate accounts might not be as high. Uh, I don't know. I don't recall the super gold. No, okay. Hmm. Well, it, well, I have to say, this is a nice poison color. Mix up, what are gonna happen? Nothing. Oh, well blocked. Yeah. Moat. Oh, nice fireball. Air fireball. Touch the whip. Craftmaster is just trying to wait out the uh, B, B, B trigger. That's all. Oh, that could, that could have been dead. Did the comeback oh. from Craftmaster double low, cheeky? That was uh, that was pretty risky. Ult he blocked those. Ult 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 had that, <laughs> yeah. had that first round with the heavy punch into the. If you've done AX a heart raid, the, the whip into oh, okay. the blight heel kick. Well, there's easy, kicks from easy, the, the second one um, is very minus compared to the first one, so you're taking a bit of a risk there, assuming Think? they're going to push a button. Big crash, airtime, marble. The loops. Oh, take down. Let's go. Nice. But uh, no, there's like a five frame gap between those two kicks, so. I you, 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 you can interrupt some of them, but you can't... Uh, if you're doing the medium ones, you can interrupt. I don't know if you can interrupt when you go to a low from a medium. I think it changes. I don't know. I'm fairly sure I can EX legs in between both all okay. variations. Because EX legs the crutch. <laughs> Just... Akira wins. I don't think I've Five. seen the white, the white costume. What? What? He's using Ranger or Akira. Yeah. <laughs> He's got the visor up. He's using a coat or something. Oh yeah. Round one. Like, look Fight. at those pants and tell me that's not White Ranger. <laughs> Good corner carry into the corner. Akira's very dangerous in the corner. Surely Poison got to answer this. I don't know, not, 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 not having any shimmy. kind of reversal really does hurt the Poison, but... Round two. And Craftmaster looking to take the set. Heavy. Oh. Oh, that's yeah, that's punishable. You want to be doing the light one on on block at least. He drops it, unfortunate. Ba yep, yeah, bad, bad, confirm. No punish on the sweep. Dashes and crush counter and Craftmaster taking Alter for a ride. And yeah, that should take it. Looks into his eyes and then kicks him Akira in the shins. <laughs> really despicable move. I got it.
getting, ki getting kicked in the shins hurts way more than you'd expect. Like, my god. I'm, I'm not arguing. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so right. Kraft, Kraft takes that two games straight. Not sure, not sure how old the poison is, but it was a good showing from Alta. Hmm. Uh, next up, we will grab uh, Balake and Vakamoz. I've got Balake on mine. Fine. Okay, nice and simple. It's the same as his Discord, uh, as the entry rather. Love it. Oh, it makes things so much easier. <laughs> Ooh, a rog, okay. I assume you've also got Balake. I, I sent him one, I'll send another one. Right. I don't need to do the thing, excellent. Just stand there and send heavy punch. And I will do it gladly. As long as I'm not fighting any Kens. <laughs> because Ken 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 vs Rose is a uh, is a miserable experience. It's go time. Alrighty. I can join you on that front. Ken vs Gil sucks as well. Go okay. Ken. No, it's not good. Uh, literally, <laughs> literally like all of Rose's right. good, all of Rose's good pokes. It's just like, hmm. I see. I blocked that. Heavy DP. Preach. <laughs> Preach the same problem. <laughs> <laughs> they extended it. I think that's one of the buffs he got. That DP just has a little. Just gets yeah, a little literally bit, that little buff has made the matchup horrible. That, yeah, that DP range, it's like fucking Michael Jordan, that space jam, like <laughs> right at the end, they just look infinite extendo reach. Needs it, obviously. Yeah, clearly. But, but I, I, I don't need Oki, though. That, that's... Yeah, I blocked your heavy punch. Oh, I see you're cancelling that into a fight. Well, it'd be a shame if uh, both these options DP'd. You exist? DP. <sighs> They really doubled down on that stereotype, huh? Well, Ken's just mashing DP. <laughs> now they have no excuse not true, to. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Very true. Oh, we got two of the uh, two of the original bosses from Street Fighter facing off. I like that color on Rog. Round one. Dabble, that's what I use. Fight. Yeah, with 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 the purple, it's kind kind of fine. Sick. There's another person from D's. There's like five of those guys in here now. Is that new? Yeah. I don't think I've noticed it before. Nah, it's like Sun's out and a couple of other guys are all in the same club. Okay. Directing as a mod that when he does a dash punch, he doesn't go straight, he goes D's instead. <laughs> Nice finish. That was a good combat. Yeah, very nice. Round two. Fight. Oh, nice back dash to escape the uh, dash load. Oh, catches the jump with the target air. Yeah, this is the one making this pretty painful. Oh, misconfirm there. Ooh. Oh, blocks the overhead. Balake really getting a lot out of these just neutral jumps. Oh, mm. and the, the current knee just catches Vakamo's slipping and Balake equals the rounds. Bit of a ballsy dash low there, it's such a close range. 
I mean, it's so fast that often doesn't hurt to throw that out once in a while because ooh, that's a lot of damage. Mm. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, nice back throw. Take game one. Like yeah, right, rogues win. dash low. It's good. Like yeah, it's punishable, but it's good to do it every now and then because if it's the first one you've done. 95% chance you're hitting it because no one's expecting it. Mm. If it's your only strategy, on the other hand, that's when it gets. <laughs> yeah. Fight! Yeah, well, I've started playing a bit of a G and I just chuck him in here and there. Don't see him coming. Yeah. The G's one's a lot faster, though. Yeah, yeah. I should probably use it more, to be honest. <laughs> Ooh. Well, okay, controlling space really well. Ooh. Little big crush. Ooh, big damage. Ooh. Oh. Brutal round the finisher. Dashes into the crush Bro, counter and Balake takes the first round game two. As we punish. Good awareness. Nice one again. Looks like Balake's got a bit of a, a bit of a feel on those uh, straights. Yeah, yeah. He appears to have more control of the match as it's gone on. And oh, that was a sick B shift. The reactions, man. What? One, one Vakamoz, close to bringing this, this round back. Uh, uh, went for the low. I don't think that low would have killed anyway. <coughs> I felt like he dropped something there. I felt like he got in and then just didn't convert what he needed to with a couple of yeah. lows. I wonder what he was pressing to get counter hit by that crouch medium kick at the end. Crouch medium punch? Maybe. Round one. Alright, it's tied up. Fight. See the momentum's going Balake's way. Has Balake backdash at the start of every round? Uh, potentially. I, I, don't, I know quite a few people that actually do that. When I started playing G, I noticed it the most. I just start off with a uh, dash punch and always catch them as they backdash. Man, my memory's not good enough to answer that question. <laughs> I'll check next round. Nice no, jump no, over no, the no, dash no. punch. Well, they stuck. It wasn't a neutral. Karen E. Oh, this could be scary. Shift too early. And. Oh, oh that's no. DP. I think that saved in the back of one. Oh, let's go. Oh. Do you think Vakamos could have taken. That with the AX dash pump at the end of that um big I trigger think, spring? I think so for that last pixel potentially, yeah. yeah. Like I'm I'm just not sure if Rob could have actually AX dash punch at the end of that and had it connect. It's been a isn't, while since I've Yeah. Isn't there like a setup where you can like do V, v trigger stuff and you can like launch them high enough for a V skill? Isn't there a sequence that does that? I mean, I'd have to mess around with Balrog. It sounds right, I think. I've seen like Brian F or Smug do something like that. Yeah. But off the top of my head, I would not be able to give. Regardless, Balake in a looking to take the set. That's cha uh, challenging these spins. 
these things to yeah. block. Oh. Jump, jumping at Balrog is always very scary. That medium punch yeah. is... So quick, that ant here. Uh, nice jump, jump back, heavy kick. Too. He's gonna take it, 2-1. Sagat wins. Good showing from Vakamos, though. He, he, looked, like, he looked pretty good, and then uh, Balaka just adjusted. I think there was some conversions that he missed. He got in for a couple of punches, mm. but then managed to convert them into, into better damage and corner carry. But yeah, very good showing, I agree. Yeah, a few minor tweaks to his conversions, and he could have easily taken that set. So very good showing from Arkhamos. Alrighty, who do we have up next? Refresh the bracket. Uh, we are going to have Douglas and Vinny. There we go, I was a little bit early on that one. <laughs> I'll get Douglas back in here. Who does Vinny play? That's a new name as well. Uh, it's... I wouldn't be able to tell you. I am. I've invited Jai, but I haven't invited uh, Vinny. I'm rather out... Jai is Douglas. Yep. <clears throat> I'm rather out of the loop when it comes to Street Fighter these days. I just haven't been playing. So... Too much have you been playing? Metroid. Are you still Metro on Metroid? No, no, it's it's oh, not just that cool. anymore. It's okay. it's something more shameful. <laughs> you gonna my, reveal my, it to everyone? My six years of being clean of League of Legends has has ended. Oh no! D due to <laughs> Worlds and Arcane and the Project L showcase, right back in there injecting that that League of Legends into. So into my veins. Do? Or should I do that? Ah, uh, you should do that while I'm All right, Vinny. shaming uh, myself. <laughs> I did send an invite uh, okay. to Vinny as well. Um, it's the same uh, as this. All the names uh, on I the assume. bracket are meant to be the same, right? <laughs> I, okay. I assume so. Vinny, if you're listening and your name's different, let us know. All right, Vinny T. Just DM. Vinny DM. All right, done. Let's oh, see. yeah. The way League players talk about the game is absolutely hilarious. What, like, especially with Arcane out being as much of a success as it is, it's like, you may enjoy the show, don't do it to yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I saw a thing, um, I can't remember where I saw it, and it was like, you know what's funny, is that everything regarding League outside of the game is actually not that bad. Oh like yeah, good. The, the, the worst <laughs> part of League is the game itself. The the animations, the music videos, and the the, the world behind it, top notch. The game, yeah, no. So we haven't got Vinny. Maybe that's not his. Oh no, it is his CFM because it actually came up with his with his name. Um, he still hasn't arrived. Uh, do you know what he's? No. Uh, Discord is? I was going to ping him on Discord. Uh, his game crashed. He just uh, responded to me. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's just been But no, I was, I was actually looking at the numbers. All, 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 all the characters that show up in Arcane, their pick rate in game has spiked up dramatically. The loss rate has just taken the biggest nosedive. <laughs> I still I feel, feel like they've ruined Jace somehow. Like, he was good when he got released, and then, I don't know, they just kind of, like, broke his legs at some point. Uh, Jace, bad, is, man. Jace still feels good. I don't know. what. It, it's weird. I, maybe maybe it's just a me problem, but, like, whenever I play him and, for some reason, Riven, they, they just hit, like, a wet noodle. Uh, you would be a Riven player. Mm. No, I'm a Mord player. <laughs> oh, I talk to me. <laughs> Mordecai is number one. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> oh, nah. That's a meme that takes me back. But I feel like one of my first games back was against the Mord, and I got <laughs> dumpstered so goddamn much. Who it are you was... playing? Uh, Irelia, but you know. Okay. Six years of Rust, it doesn't matter how good the champion is. Right. So, what's his. Is he back? I just sent him another invite. I sent him yeah. as well. Alright. <clears throat> well, yes. 
past, Aurelia may be busted, but si six years of Rust and Silver One, I'm not, I'm not surviving that mod. It was, it was cru cruel. Yeah, it's rough. Bring back World of the Ancients, though. No. Yes. <laughs> they brought back Force of Nature, they can bring back this. So it looks like Vinny plays, uh, we got a uh, Nash, and I know Douglas plays a few, so I'll, he'll probably be sticking with Nakali for comp, but I know Douglas has a few under his belt. Oh, let's see, what do we get? Yep. Even similar colours. Another D's. They're multiplying. We're it's, get, to, it's, uh, get, it's getting out of hand now. <laughs> now there were two now. of them. <laughs> Shoot him or something. If you stand in my <laughs> way, I will kill you. Round one. Your trade federation accent Fight. needs work there, Felscrope. I wasn't trying. <laughs> Disappointing. Oh, my ethic goes into parrying, not the impressions. Mashing that disgusting Sobat kick. Nice. It, it still blows me away that MOV used Nash's Sobat kick 10,000 times in four days when it was bugged. Oh no. It's such an amazing move. It's so good. It's disgusting. <laughs> Nice severe reversal. Lands on the vomit. Oh. Oh, I thought he could finish it there, but no. Crouch, crouching so long with the vomit, he passes underneath the right sun of yeah. Very good ant here. <laughs> Round two. I feel like there was some divine intervention a couple of times in that round for Douglas. My god. Can we take those? Pretty interesting matchup, it's not one I've actually seen too much of. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. I, don't think, I, mean, um, I don't think you see many Nikalis these days, I don't think they're I mean, you don't, you don't see many Nikalis, and before Nash's buff, like, Nash was... Nash players are an endangered species, it felt like. Mm. Well, that's a Nash. I know of is what he said. Nash. Oh no, he had that, he went the wrong button. Cool. Oh, tricky. tricky! Yep. Nice, nice attempt with the the DP. I don't think he he didn't ex there. Might might have saved him. Yes, we'll never know. I didn't convert that one. So all those moon salts are plus on block, which is I think telling you. Oh, nice one! Nice vomit trap. Oh, unfortunate. But Remind me, do you do you need to block the the vomit low or like can you just stand block it? I think you can stand block it. Oh nice cancel of the nice use of the V trigger to just get that throw. Nash wins. And Vinny takes game one. I think that Nash did also get that trigger buffed, and now he's. I think he gets five of those little teleport thingies, or those rushes, whatever you want to call them. That's There's cool. quite a few. <laughs> yeah, five's a lot. Round you can do some one. pretty swag combos. Fight. Sonic. 
Nice idea for Douglas to use the, uh, the dash through the fireball. Did just get somersault kick, whatever it's called from Nash, for his trouble. Punishable, got him in the corner. Oh no. Himself straight into the corner. EX stomps out. I haven't seen the command grab yet from Douglas. No. Nice through the sonic boom. Heavy kick. Round two. To be fair, I, I I don't remember the frame advantage command grab on the car it gives you. But unless you're spending a bar on it to follow up with DP, the damage is pretty low, so Command grab. Yeah, and the Yeah, I guess, I guess yeah, I guess it sets up the combo. It's quite similar to G, right? G's one's, uh... Oh, Sven's a CA. Um, you have to follow up with something, I guess, to get... To get yeah. Ready. Nash gets Oki here. Oh, he's gone for the... Oh, he's gonna yeah, I suppose you... You can still threaten with it, but... Maybe he just... Maybe Douglas just doesn't find it worth the this risk is a punish. of... Whipping a command grab. Oh, this, that was off an activation, right? So that's yeah, that's gonna thing. scale badly. Yeah. Alright, I don't know if Natali gets Hoki here, I don't think so. Still. Oh, oh. <laughs> we went for it anyway! Is that like a triple dash into the corner? Yeah, it was a triple. <laughs> uh, jabs at that, Terrace. That, that V-trigger Natali dash... Natali wins. Is... He's dashing that fast, he went, oh shit, and V-shifted. <laughs> There's some glowing purple thing running at me. <laughs> Get me out. Abort, Nicar abort. Natali's got those... <laughs> Those Marvel vs. Capcom dashes in, in V-Trigger just... Slide all over the place. Is this, is this the, the V-Trigger that doesn't run out? Fight. Number two? Yeah, yeah number two one? is the... Two is the infinite. Yeah, okay. Good idea, but not strong. Yeah. Ooh, challenges oh, okay. the AX stop. That was an interesting... They're punished. Big crush. Oh, nice use of the dive kick mm. to navigate the fireball. Nice. Oh, oh, very nice. That was cool. <sighs> Nice challenge. Oh, is that a back dash? Oh, okay. Back dash. Nice. Is, is this? Right. Okay. This no. is it, man. There's a guess for the win. What's okay. gonna happen? Wow. Wow. Oh, Nash is... Oh, no, shimmy. Uh, got the shimmy. Nash is CA. Fairly low damage. Like, I don't have time for this. Round two. Maybe because he gets Oki off it. Mm. There's always a follow-up for Nash. Because you, you, after you dash in, I think you're plus four. Or Plus four, maybe plus three. Uh, I think you told me it was three last time. I think. Yeah. Because I asked you about that last time we played. Because yeah. yeah, uh, it's always an option. You go for a throw. You go for the overhead. You go for a um, tragedy assault. There's a lot of options there after the dash. Most people think you're gonna throw. So even a shimmy, shimmy can do it. Does um, tragedy assault work as a throw bait? Yes. Broken. Yeah, Nash. <laughs> Where's Pass? Pass should be saying something about Nash. I'm sure he's saying something about Nash or Kaching in chat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Top one. <laughs> pass, pass is, if nothing, predictable with his... Uh, oh, that was a very nice move. Nash hate. Mm, very good. The one time he goes for command grab and he gets V-shifted. Yeah. Nash, not, not worth the risk. Feels bad, man. Unlucky. That was a good showing, though. Um, mm. Well done, Benny. Don't think I've seen you play, but nice Nash. Now that I've seen the Nash... The name does kind of ring a bell, but yeah, very well done. All right, where are we going now? So, Silver Apples and Mighty Midori. I think I've got Silver Apples on mine. Uh, 
Silver Rifles, yep. There's so many people are my favourites. <laughs> yeah, it, it exploded when I started doing all this commentary stuff because it's just easier having the regulars. Oh, totally. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Uh, is someone born. getting a Mighty Midori? Yeah, I just sent him an invite. Right. What? Yep, here they are. All right. All right. So I, I know definitely know Silver Apple does Ryu. Um, Mighty Midori looks like there's an Akira there. Don't know if that's what we're going to see. Uh, I'd be very yep. surprised if Silver Apple doesn't play Ryu though. Yeah. I mean, we've already been bamboozled once by Alta, so maybe <laughs> Midori. Right. Maybe Midori will bust out someone other than. What, what does my, I'm sure I've seen the name before, but I don't remember Mighty Midori being the, being the hero. Yeah, he is. He is, okay. So let's just have a look what's also been happening in the bracket to a refresh. What do we have midnight down in losers? What happened? Wait, what? Oh, uh, Professor. Uh, ah, okay. that, that makes sense. Yeah. I didn't imagine this. Oh, Douglas vs. Alta, that actually would be pretty good. That's Danny Losers, though. Suns out and back of that'd be nice. This is the path of my destiny. Alright. It's so weird when Akira's got this costume and comes in on the bike, it does not go together. But... <laughs> what is it? Is it a nurse costume? That's a maid. That's a maid. Okay. It's another one from D's. How many D is there? I said there's D's almost every, every every stream, every game we've had on stream. Just about. Oh, oh, oh it's oh, a no. XD fair. It's big damage for it. The mix. Oh, I get it. Oh, bit too early. <clears throat> Unfortunately, Silver Ankle still got clipped by the the Daigo Flames. I think he was too far, um, even for a regular heavy DP there, so he'd have to possibly do stand heavy punch tattoo, maybe? Uh, Akira, are you talking about? For no, Ryu, the oh, silver. Ryu, yeah. When he got, the, he got the solar plexus, and then he whiffed the EX? Yeah, yeah. Heavy DP, though. No fear. Okay. Oh, the mix! <laughs> Best mix is the accidental mix. How can my opponent react accordingly when not even I know where I'm going to land? He tried for DP there. Nice. The, the fear of Daigo just allows Midori to get that, that cheeky low. Akira just wins. Watch them ankles. It's pretty good reach on that, that crouching medium. I, when I play Akira, I managed to clip quite a few people with it. And it does um it does cancel into the uh, any your animal. So you can use that you know, to, to close yourself back up. At, that's the sign of a good crouch medium kick. Mm -hmm. Cancelable and decent range. I think Luke, has Luke got one as well? I didn't watch the whole Luke showcase, but I think he's got a yeah, cancelable. Yeah, he does have a cancelable crouch medium kick. Yeah. Looks like a decent window too. <clears throat> like some characters. Um. Alright, let it go. <laughs> <laughs> Big crush. Lots of pokes in this one. No, not any big conversions yet. Hey, shins are sore. Hey, into the corner. Oh. Get off me. Silver, silver <laughs> has had enough of it. There we go, converts that time. Alright. Nice new combo to take the round. Round two. Mm. 
There's something interesting too, is it's um, unless, unless it's Ken I think, uh, you should always quick rise if you get hit by XDP, uh, because no one really gets okay off of it, except Ken. Yeah. Even Akuma? Even Akuma. Hmm. Corner's obviously different oh. than corner, but... Yeah. Uh, I haven't uh, seen this uh, costume change. Um, we've got the Easter egg costume. The, um, something yeah, missing, the, right? Yeah, the the Up costume missing? code I think changes the hair hair ornament. Okay, yeah, all right. Now the hair's changed. Yep. So, so something looks different. I couldn't put my finger on it. Oh. Ouch. You win. Alright, so the top tying it up, Mana Pace. Round one. Fight! Sato. Eats the overhead. Oh, Ooh, misses. Unfortunately, misses. Times the uh, follow up after the little Daigo Foley and just misses the uh, the launcher. Can you follow up there? Yep. I'm fairly sure I've seen a Kira's do. 100% you can. I did, uh, did it today. <laughs> you just have to be at the right spot, otherwise, he just flips over. She kind of works a little bit forward when she launches. Uh, yeah. but you can fall on the wrong side. Uh. Oh, yeah, 19 seconds. Oh, hit me there. The light kick whiffed. Unfortunate. Round two. Fight. Oh, Ruffles come out of the gates blazing this round. A big crash. Agree with that activate that. I don't think they, um, I think that was to make it safe, maybe. I wasn't sure that was, yeah, that wasn't a really uh, good No one's idea. punishing that on the shit Chun Lee. Yeah, that's true. Oh, uh, that was that double dash for Oki after that. Oh, oh. Unfortunately, I think that happened. That happened at the end of the last uh, last game as well. Yeah, he walks forward a bit too much and eats fireball for him for his troubles. I I take my eye off the game for one second and pass is saying Ramblethor Super is fair and some. Some days I wonder why is this guy allowed to talk? Why is he not? Why is he not blocked? He he doesn't deserve speaking privileges sometimes. Could be worse. Could be Naga. No, he could have said Garuda Impact is fair. I mean, it's not fair. The 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 sh the, the the difference is very minimal. So like. You can't loop Ram Super. So, next and game... Zip saying buff Nago, and I've lost all respect for that man as... Based. Give him uh, a dash. Hell yeah, dude. My Rota, and... 
Oh, Danish, Danish is back. Too. Someone do those, I don't have either of those on my list. Right. Takes me a while, I'm on my PS, which means I gotta type <laughs> each letter in. My runner. Gotcha. Done. Both. Excellent. Hmm. Looking for a refresh. What's going on? The Silver Apples will be progressing to face Dragnor. Who sent Balaki to losers? Um, any other big things going on? Not really. Looks like Losers is a bit behind as well. <clears throat> oh, Let's try my rotor again. Oh, no. oh familiar? No way, dude. Well, okay, saying a uh, buff Chun in the chat, and you know what? Get out. <laughs> no, he can stay. No, 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 get out. <laughs> no. You can buff yeah. Chun if you delete back Heavy Punch. No. Didn't, didn't back Heavy Punch get nerfed a little bit? I don't care, it's annoying. Eh, eh, eh. Oh, oh it, is, it is annoying. It is annoying. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll give you that. It's it totally was annoying. more annoying in Third Strike. At least I'm not gaining meter for whipping normals. Ah, <laughs> uh, my run away yet, bros. See if I can uh, um, ping him in chat. I, no, I am the voice. I am the voice of reason when it comes to Chun in regards to Fell Scribe. This man has very heavy PTSD. I don't know. I don't know what caused it, but. Oh, I, I wouldn't know either. I just, I don't know, crush counters uh, over and over again. Do do things. I mean that that would probably learn you for pressing buttons at bad opportunities. You'd think, but then I also did red fireball on block against your Chun for about a year before I actually started to curb it. <laughs> started, and then you fell off the wagon and kept doing. <laughs> Right, I'll just ping him in chat uh, in the Discord. <clears throat> there he is. Ah, there he is. Uh, I don't know how I feel about uh, taking Dan into Geef. It seems like a bad time. Oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> yes. oh I hate calling for nurse to his own character. <laughs> yeah, I, I can't imagine I'd be too keen on doing Dan kicks into a Zangief. No, like yeah. that, that, I, I that, that just <laughs> that just feels like you you're asking for the churn to uh, scoop you up. I'm very intrigued to, about how this will go. I I just don't know. Yeah, Visca might be a bit of an issue as well for Dan because he doesn't really have any multi-hitting things. Yeah, to deal Round with the armor. One. Yeah, Fight. it's only one hit, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, if you don't hit, I suppose if he did like EX Dan kicks when he saw it. Yeah, but. My rota moves around with the V-Skill, like a, Ooh, fair, nice. a fair bit, so... Oh, big W. No, I'm not uh oh even. Might have some lag issues. Yeah. Surprised the number of um, matches we've had with colour-coordinated costumes. I'm 
not in on this one, so I'll take it for it. And, uh, I'll watch the stream. Alrighty, so. All this. The with CA. Danish doesn't capitalize. That could be Elder. Nah, that's not dead. <laughs> Next one, though, is. Round two. Fight. Oh, nice air SPD. Catch is dangerous jumping. Uh, I wonder if that was a start up of the EX Den kick sled off. It was, and it just got hit out by, uh... Yeah, just... V-Skill... ...stuffed it. Ooh, un unfortunate. Yeah, just frame Corey you can. Yeah, takes game one. To honor father, big bro will do his best. Aish seems to have a habit that I've got where you hit an air to air to air and as you land you come up with an EX move and I think he's done it pretty much every time I've seen both people land at the same time. So we'll see if my rotor picks up on that. Round one. Fight. The red fireball. Nice conversion there. Alright, Daniel's got my rotor in the corner. Oh, hey, it led me into the game. I can compensate now. <laughs> Yay! Welcome back. And look at that. Dan kick into SPD. Yep. Wait, oh. Wiss, he's. Wiss the throw. Gets... Yep. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that is unfortunate for Danish. Oh, yeah. Right. Interesting interaction. Nice. I feel this, this game might be affected by a bit of lag. We've seen a few crazy inputs. Yeah, that's definitely a possibility. What, what can you do on online tournaments? This happens. That V skill, v skill 2 by Geep, does that leave him plus? Minus 4. Minus 4. <clears throat> um, but he's usually too far away to do anything. Um, but with my rotor specifically, he usually jabs afterwards, so if you get yep. a move that can reach, um, you can counter hit. Yep. After I played him, that was something I went and left. I've seen him throw out the, uh, the SPD sometimes after it as well, so I guess if you're trying to take your turn back, you can get grabbed. Only those. if you whiff. Only if you whiff, yep. yep. Otherwise you hit him at the start. Oh, just out of range for any follow-up from that jump in. So I think he might want to be doing the uh, stand medium kick to try and take his turn back. Light SPD catches a jab. And another one. Pliable. No. Missed the XTP input. Catch me over here. My raider's got a CA ready to go. No yeah, punish you... on the sweep. Yeah, the jump back after the sweep uh, was not what you were looking for. Allowed him to just get double lariated and my rotor ties it up. Round one. Fight. 
fight! Oop. I wrote it going the party started early in this final game. Just back dashes out of it. And Danish getting some damage. Come back time, let's go. Yep, my turn still. <laughs> Hold that. Chance between the string. Yep, get off me again. Do it. And I'll do I it will, again. I will keep my pressure. You will stay in this corner. Oh, nice, nice Visco follow up to take the round. Come back in a hundred million years. Round two. Oh, that, one? that wing quote. I wonder if, um, if Dan does stand heavy kick at max range, can he be grabbed? Uh, I'm gonna go with yes. <laughs> Just throwing it out there. Not too sure. There's been a lot of wake up DPs. Um, my Ren is getting hit by a lot of them. I think he wants to keep up his pressure. That's uh, Z Z Zangief does that to a man. Just. Oh, interrupts the churn. Checks it. This is still... Oh. I have many questions. <laughs> that was a bit spaghetti right though. I think... Probably could have only gone for the air SPD though. Just... I think just the way... The way he landed on the V-trigger spin. Maybe a headbutt. Danish is a bit unsure of himself here. What's up, what's up? Too far, oh, nice. No. Oh, unfortunate <laughs> whiff on the CA. Danish can got to make the most out of this. Interrupts with the SPD. Ooh. Yeah, he was too far out for those EX Dan kicks. Only one hit. Landed, so the vesicle armor just. Hey, you blocked the DP. Yes, that's what I was waiting for. Well done. On, uh, on block, the EX Dan kicks only do one hit anyway. Yeah. Uh, so like when it gets armored, it's kind of the same. Okay. Um. Well, I just thought it was a. I just thought it was a distance thing. Like, no, it's um like because when you do um when you block Rob's EX straight, it only does one hit. Kind of the same deal. All right, coming up next, we've got Halfmaster and Professor. Interesting one. Where are they? Uh, All right, I have one. Sink craft. I've done Professor. Woo. Rather fight Geef than Dan. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not sure who I'd rather fight, to be honest. <laughs> All right, just waiting on busy. So will Craftmaster keep the Akira going? Yeah, I think he's very committed to uh, the Akira. Akira nice. is just not as good with zoners, I find. So Craft I don't Master, know. Crafty does have a bison. Okay. 
so he might bring the bison because counter. We won't see the Karen. I mean, yeah, he can no, always but... bust. He can always bust out old faithful Karen, but I guess it's just getting around the fireball game, right? So I, I know Akira would struggle with that. You've got to be close to do the uh, do the DP that goes through the fireballs, so you still have to make a bit I of ground like... up before that'll work. I feel like V Skill One negates that weakness on Akira with the enhanced fireballs, like. Because a friend of mine was using the V Skill One. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And especially like. Call it. Especially EX like V Skill One on Akira, to, like you yeah, get yeah. that wall bounce wall from bounce well. so yeah. far away. If they yeah, throw right. a bad fireball. Yep. No, very, very, very good call. I don't, I don't use that, and I reckon I should add that to my game. Um, using the EX fireball. But we've got a. Two of the old masters playing together. Oh, well, I put the sweep. Classic bison. Catches the start up of the fireball there with the EX scissors. He's skill 2, okay. So when he charges that up, the uh, knees are going to be plus no matter what. Good conversion. Oh, he tried for it, I respect it. That's your reverse one. That's very hard to do the cross cuts on Sagat because of his weird hitbox. Very difficult. That and Bison can just change his trajectory on on descent. Yeah, you're better off just jumping and doing a button after yeah. the, uh, the blocked head stomp. Yeah, just a jump back jab or whatever is usually safer. Would the V shift leave him pretty exposed there? Is it hard to time there? Yeah, I, I think it's a specific timing you need for the V shift. I would only ever V shift the EX one because the EX one tracks, the others are like a fixed distance. Gotcha. Um, yeah, I would have reversed there too, that's plus eight. Oh. Spends the meter, gets that nice easy kill. Final round. Fight. Nice jump on the scissors, forces a bar waste. Good conversion. Oh, very nice. Nice teleport through the fireball. Very good. Plus. Oh, Too unfortunate. Yeah, Craftmaster just can chill with that life blade and. And Bison wins. The Crash Heavy Trade. Start head stop just preempts the fireball. Fireball catches the scissor kick. Nice two. Nice 
as for a heavy tiger knee it gets interrupted. Unfortunate. Plus. Oh, this nice be conversion. That's gonna yeah. kill. One hundred percent. That's the easy, easy death. Craftmaster got caught slipping, and Professor made him pay for it. Round two. You love to see. Fight. Nice, not biting on the uh, on the plus frames there. Oh, nice hand here. Plus crusher. Frame trap. That'll do it. Ah. Nice. Nice. I feel like Professor's getting a bit of a so read God. here Wait. on the scissors. He's neutral jumping a fair bit. He's trying to yep. uh, trying to get a nice jump in punish. Professor with I I think actually both our Sugats here have been pretty clean with their neutral jumps to avoid pressure mm. or evade certain situations. Round one. Fight! Oh. Yeah, that's actually something I haven't seen Kraft utilize enough. He's got that fireball absorb V skill for Python, but... Ah, uh, but the thing is though, Professor's not one to really throw a whole bunch of fireballs. He's more um, controlling space with his normals. Mm, but he, uh, he... Yeah, even when he does, like... It's rare to see... It's been rare to see Craftmaster use that beast skill. Yeah. Lots of parry as well, right? Yeah, Great. like... Yeah, yeah. Round two. Fight! Next needs get some B+. Not bison, scouts. <laughs> oh, big damage off that counter head. Stagger there. A lot of grey. Oh, this is scary. Catch him. He panicked. I was expecting the uh, slide cancel into Psycho Crush, but didn't see it. Yeah. Good job, Professor. 2 1. Craftmaster probably wasn't ready to ante you there and. Cost him the set. Fairly sure Bison's anti there would have won cleanly. Mm. But, unfortunate. We've all we've all had those with the anti airs. It hurt. It hurts. Yep. All right. Uh, so we're gonna get my Rota and Prosperous Friend in here. Be our next game. Alright. <laughs> I read Prosperous Fried.
Is he, is he under that account or or is on another one? Who prosperous? Yeah, doesn't he have another account? Uh, he's booting up apparently. Oh, okay. Oh, what else is oh Edwin underscore Sorto. He's on a different one. There you go. <clears throat> I'm going to stop typing names, <laughs> you're just spelling everything wrong. <laughs> it looks like Midnight took out Danish Coup. Yeah, Midnight's having a good losing gonna, run. He's going to tear his way up to top four and possibly beyond. Douglas vs Dragnor, that would be a good game. Mm. Yes, I want to I wanna see Dragnor make it through. No buys. None whatsoever. But we could see a, uh, a loser's final game with um, with those two, uh, Midnight and Dragnor. If they get towards the end, they're on different sides of the losers. I think Midnight can take that one. Yeah, I, I think it's even. I, I wouldn't be surprised either way. Alright, um... Edwin saying, send the invert. Sent. Alrighty. Both our players are here. SPD and another and another and to start that should be the mat on the round yep Of Larius there. Mm, very good. Right, I, had, I, I zoned out for most of that first round due to distractions, but um, how, how did that first round go between these two? Was it close? Uh, lots of Grab SPDs. <laughs> very grabby. Let's just call it very grabby. Hugs were had. Yeah. Nice back I think, dash. I think if Edwin can just sort of get out of the uh, out of that range of those. Um... Oh. That's gonna catch him. Yeah. That uh, is very close to death. I reckon Edwin did crash when he kicked there. He got uh, SP, uh, what's called C8 for it. Oh, we took a two? Okay. Very, very dead bison if Gave gets the next hug. Oh, oh no! There it is. Oh no! <laughs> 
Yeah, v v -trig v trigger two is quite interesting for this matchup. I would have, mm, I would have yeah. thought the one would have been good um, to stop those air approaches from Bison. You thought your fireball was a setup for your gameplay? <laughs> no, it's for my win condition. <laughs> Bitch. Round one. Fight! Oh, I mean, that, that air SPD ha would have had to put some kind of fear into Edwin because I know I'd, I'd be a little broke after that. Yeah. Unlucky. Like back dash. I'll jump back. I'll up. Well, jumps okay. into the end of the lariat. Bear grab the chase down. Indy jump is pretty nice. Another bear grab. More hugs. <laughs> Italia! My rotor <laughs> is just. Not taking any of Bison's Fight. shenanigans. He's gonna need some Panadol after that one. Yeah, bad idea. Light SPD, so the party. Oh, he tried to parry. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> you gotta give props for every time Gex tries Tundra Storm. <laughs> Intentional <Never> or not. <laughs> Does Bison have any kicks that get parried by? I think he tried to do the scissors. I'm pretty sure he can work on the scissors. Oh. And um, stemmy and kick. A bit of a Ooh. taunt. That was a very uh, odd place to do a taunt. Rider taunts back. Uh, oh, I thought there was going to be another air SPD, but no. I don't, I don't know why you try that setup. Larry goes through projectiles and it's an anti air. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Probably no. not aware, but my rotor sweeping. On Edwin's wake up, it's like no, you, you get, back, <laughs> you get back on that ground, boy. <laughs> Just sweeping on wake you, up, right? You, you stay there. You stay on that ground. Well, that was pretty, uh, pretty uh, dominant by my road mm. there. I think Edwin looked a bit uncomfortable, um, given that you know you get scooped for doing bison things. It's yeah, yeah. It's kind of rough. Mm-hmm. Cathartic uh, to watch a bison get punished for their shenanigans. To be therapeutic. <laughs> Just. Alright, <sighs> so we have Professor and Silver Apples. I have both those guys. Kind of. Uh, Professor. And Silver Apples. So this will be Sagat vs Ryu. Uh, and I think these guys are actually playing this afternoon. Um, so let's see how much they can remember of each other's um, game plans. Yeah, should be good to see. It's go time. So, did either of you guys try the KOF 15 beta the last? couple of days? I did not. I've heard some talk about it. Um, I'm assuming it's only on um, PC, right? No, only PS4. PS4? Oh, yeah. Yeah, what? As in PS or PS4? Yeah, PS4. Okay. They, they, they never release betas right. on PC, it seems. I've only seen it on consoles. I, I wish I had more time to play it, but like, I've got no no controllers that work on PlayStation, like no sticks or hitboxes, so I would have had to use pad and ish. That's nothing just... wrong. Nothing wrong with pad. <laughs> Not when you haven't used them before in a long time. It's there's everything wrong with pad in that. 
I couldn't imagine going back to pad, even for a little bit. Yeah, it, it it's weird. I can't imagine playing on anything else. It's what you're used to, I guess. But it has to be yeah, six button. The uh, if it's not a six button pad, I can't. I can't do it. No, none of the standard PlayStation no, 4 no, shenanigans. None of that. None of that. Round Fighting one. Commander. That's the way to go. Fight. Person looked very aggressive to start. Great end here. Oh, unfort. That that had to have been an act like a missed input DP, that fireball, after Professor had jumped. Oh. Quite a few frame traps uh, there. I think Professor thought there was a, a tick throw coming, but it was just a uh, medium punch. I, w I was surprised by the sweep from Silver Apples there. I thought he could have done like anything else to extend the combo and get the stun, but it worked out for him. I'd have to watch it back to see what exactly Silver Apples did. Big jump in, big combo. Big damage. <laughs> oh, uh, oh, I'm what happened there? Oh, you can kill. No good punish on the with DP from Silver Apples. That's that one could have been the kill quite easily, but um. Yeah, that very easily. <laughs> it was a crouching medium punch to jump back. I've never seen that before. Very unique. Uh, <laughs> Chicago punish. DP, put it back in the corner. Yeah, it's very hard now where his punches are all extremely powerful when he's on trigger. Oh. That's one way out of it. Final round. Fight. One last jump. I'm Silver Apple's just getting hit by everything. Just lad. Professor doing a good job just keeping him out. Dictating the flow of the match. Now he's just jumping at Silver Apples and getting DP'd for his troubles. Oh unlucky. You hate to see it, but Nice cross cut. Ah, Silver Apples had that. Let it go. Yeah, he just this didn't follow combo. up Sagat with wins. the rest of the target combo. Gave well, Professor a chance to. With 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 what he was trying to do there, I think you have to delay the medium punch into the standing heavy punch to get the ex donkey kick out. If it starts off as the target combo, it finishes off as the uh, just a roundhouse. So. I think that delay button caused him to miss one. that, the next one. Uh, what, kind of what it felt like, because I think he was going for that big punish. Yeah. Unfortunate. But... Gotta, gotta learn from that mistake. Not not going for a crush down to punish. For a bit more damage. Nice simple two hit combo after the anti air fourth. Around.
Ah, the AX Fireball from Silver Apples to win the Fireball exchange. After those EX Fireballs, you should always be double dashing and you'll still get OP. We, anytime, anywhere Ryu hits you with an EX Fireball, he'll get OP. So wait. Oh. Who should be double dashing after the EX Fireball? Uh, Ryu. Ryu. Yeah. He recovers really quick from it so he can get in. <clears throat> oh, that's good. Oh, oh, whoa! What was that? Nice. <laughs> I want to say nice, nice cross cut, but <laughs> dash to get cross cut. Miss DP. Crash heavy punch. Anti air. Better than nothing. He's trying to bait the um, trying to bait a DP up, and it's not coming. Uh, no, it's not enough. Yeah. Uh. Yep, that's a nice spot too. Space knees to get the back throw for the, the set. I think EX knees still pull... Is it still plus no matter how badly you space it? Does that have to be space? No, they are punishable. Yeah. The, the EX one? Yeah, the EX one's punishable. Okay. Okay. Ma maybe if he had the V skill enhanced ones. Yeah, yeah, but he was that, running VS1 that, that game. Yeah. yeah. Um, Alright, good showing. That was pretty good for Professor. Well done. Alrighty, so uh, should we have already swapped the best of three? Uh, uh, no, not, not yet. in semis. Okay, so now that we're at winners finals, winners final, yeah. Uh, let's just see how loses. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Okay. All right. So we'll drop down to losers, grab silver apples and midnight, and then we can just, uh, get our first of threes underway. Alrighty. So. Right, I've got both of those. Where I invite uh, Silver Apple. Get back in here and midnight. Oh. I checked Twitter for a second, and I see a Honzo Gonzo tweet that. Oh boy, that's that's something else. Uh, come on. Busy, you gotta drop for us, mate. Alright, so who's been taken out so far? Midnight's had a pretty good losers run up to here. Vinny took out Vinny DM, took out Danish Coup. Uh, it's happening on the other side of losers, so Prosperous is look, waiting for the winner of Dragnor and Sun's out. Interesting, I think my Street Fighter V has crashed. You haven't loaded in either? Uh, yeah, mine, it, mine frozen too. Yeah, it says Silver Apple's readied up. Midnight's got the red select. square over the select and... Yeah, mine like, seems to be quite frozen. I can move. I, I, like yeah, I can move, really but... The lobby. Are they, <laughs> they going to play it? We're not going to be able to see it. <laughs> I can't... All of us couldn't have all been stuck, can we? Yeah, it is. This, this feels... Oh no. This <laughs> <laughs> oh no, hold on. No, mid midnight's oh. back on for ready. Okay, here we go. <laughs> yeah, okay, so Ap okay. Apple looks like he's frozen midnight's on ready. I think Apple will be potentially booted. Um, yep, there he goes. Yes, there he goes. Alright, so let's try that again. Um, he probably has to restart, so he's not going to be anywhere in here. We could do the thing now if you <laughs> want. How many Why crashes have we time? had? Yep, I mean, if you're ready to do it, you can do it. Might as well, kill some uh, if time. That's, if that's cool with Busy. Busy? May, may, may as well. 
Um, cool. So uh, while Silver Apples reboot, um, we're going to uh, remind that there is the last uh, Unger for Guilty Gear Strive to... Uh, sorry. Wait, hang on. No, for Street Fighter. Uh, when's that? Is that Sunday? Yeah, Sunday. Yeah. 21st. I don't have the image um, on hand, so I'm, I'm like winging okay, it right this, now. Okay, <laughs> this, this is an out-of-date image. I was just like, yeah, I, was, I was looking at that, yeah. like, hang on a minute. It's, that's, that's been and gone. <laughs> I, I, I had to double-check the date there. I was like, hmm, that might be problematic. All right, everyone, get get getting your TARDISes and, or your DeLoreans and... Uh, Make sure to be there Sunday 21st for <laughs> Guilty Gear Strive under around 6. <laughs> oh, that is... <laughs> so that I is a we'll, good we'll, marketing we'll genius. <laughs> uh, right, wow, two, two busy. Back, so. <laughs> uh, wow, busy just flexing the fact that he has a time traveling machine. It's just like, yeah, just... Go back to four days ago, you filthy, filthy character. We need one of those screenwriting tools where you can just cross out Strive and write SFV and like make edits on the image. <laughs> uh, uh, anyway, I, I, th I, th I think it's on Sunday. <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll roll with that. And if it's we'll, not, we'll, I apologize. We'll, we'll to <laughs> check, check tournaments on the weekend. Uh, you guys want to drop? We got Silver <laughs> Apple Pats. <laughs> Oh man! It's go oh, <laughs> well, well, we'll retake that one after the set. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll we'll get back to you on that one. Uh, Busy, can you drop, please? Cool. Let's go. How many crashes have we had? <laughs> what was the third or fourth crash? <laughs> the the street. Oh, that is that is just the <laughs> the right levels of cursed. Let's do this. <laughs> <laughs> Good enough. <laughs> oh man. Oh, poor busy. All right, tomorrow seven thirty around. Uh, seven thirty around six. For Unga, go do it. Last one. Be there or be square. Well, that's that was a good bit of comedy. <laughs> I think we all needed. Round one. Is that color darker than usual? Which uh, one? Purple. Reused purple. To be honest, I kind of forgot Ryu had this costume, so I. Couldn't tell you. Uh, I always use the, uh, the white color. I mean, I'm running away with this one by the looks of it. Yeah. Oh, whiff. Whiff punishes on the solar plexus. Big crash. Is that? Was... No. Oh. Nice oh, cross cut. cut. Stays on the cross same cut. side, though. Cheeky air fireball. Akuma wins. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> All right.
Alright, so Midnight takes it. Round Fairly confident confidently, I'd say, that, that first game. And Silver Apples adapt, or will... Ooh. That'd be a funny thing. Oh, nice, nice raid on the fireball. Good staggered pressure from Midnight. Not, not punished from the 10 medium kick into the fireball. Then I'll just keep, keep doing it. Don't press there. Now yeah, I thought yes. you could press a button, think again. Oh Please boy. I was just trying to get XDP out of that, but the fireball came out and just got hit. Controlling all aspects of the moment, ground, air. Yep. Very, very one-sided affair at the moment. Just. Oh. No, this means trying to find the spacing to set up for a sick whiff punish. Interesting Tatsu from Midnight, but. Oh, shimmy. Oh, shimmy. Shimmy. Get off me. There's the DP. Sil Silver Apples had had enough of Midnight shenanigans. Just let's rip the EXDP. Silver working on the stun. Oh, missed DP. Oh, big jump. Uh, okay. Combo will do it. Or that. Oh, oh. Where nice read. <laughs> like a book. Midnight miscalculated with the quick math. Oh, missed. Silver Apple survived with a sliver, but I think I think he would have killed if he didn't do that combo with ended in that random heavy tattoo that only hit like two out of three times or whatever. I think he would have been right, and he did calculate correctly. It's just that that messed up combo potentially cost him I'm, that round. I mean, yeah, but you you can't just suddenly put in variables like that. He that was not intentional, and I'm pretty sure Midnight knows that's not intentional. What he did that that mm. Tatsu um, is probably kicking himself a little bit for that. I know I would be. That's all right. Well, that was still a pretty convincing win. Oh, uh, sure. I'm not taking. I'm not taking that away from him at all. Hmm. But um, I'm, I'm sure he'll agree that uh, he didn't want that. So, are you guys going to do the ad? <clears throat> uh, yeah, take two uh, before we get I to our first of threes. I don't know what you're talking about. What's this take two? <laughs> um, so, uh, another announcement uh, is that tomorrow at seven thirty. Uh, we have the final round for Street Fighters, uh, sorry, for Unger Down Under Street Fighter Tournament. Your last chance to make top eight uh, or to get some points and um, participate. So make sure you guys tune in uh, for that one and, and register as well if you haven't already. I've been pretty slack in registering on those, so I'm going to try and make the effort as much as possible to get in on that one. So we went to the last one, but I got sidetracked. So make sure you guys rock up for that one. For the last oh. show, good show, good last one. All right, that, that, that slide is... Uh... 
and Daigo will be there as well because <laughs> because why not? Yeah, exactly be, right. <laughs> be there or get T poses on and buy Ryu. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so... Winner's Next. Finals? Yeah, oh. Winner's Finals. So we go my uh, own Professor. Uh, we're Need best to change it to three now. Uh, yeah, oh. first to three, yeah. First to three, sorry. Why, why wouldn't Daigo be there, Zip? Exactly, yeah, I've seen too many questions. <laughs> nah, no DMCA right. here, we'll just churn them down the memory hole. Censorship and stuff. <laughs> Buzzwords and. Yeah. Deal with it. What's up? <laughs> are, we st are, we are we still waiting on my Brodo? Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty. I don't think you can D DMCA people for a image. Don't give China ideas, all right? Or Nintendo or whoever's doing the censoring lately. I was, I was about to say, I was about to say, Daigo's Japanese, but like, let's just ignore that. Uh... Yeah, but Jap Japanese, like, they don't, they don't censor. What? Stuff. Ca no, I was about to say, careful, careful of your next couple of words. Cause I know what oh, I was doing. Yeah, it's slippery slope. Nah, it's not slippery slope at all. <laughs> Copyright strike is the ultimate ten zero matchup, and Fuchs is uh, dubbing us in to, uh, Xi Jinping as well. Fox got Winnie the Pooh on uh, speed dial, it seems. Yes, uh, Fuchs, I'm well aware of that. You can come see me in Toowoomba in uh, two months. Your come to the facility down there. My Bring me a new stick, because they're going to take this one. They'll think it's a bomb or something. Round one. Fight! Yes, he is, Zip. Yes, he is. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> uh, my roadie giving out lots of hugs this round. That uh, V skill doing a bit of work, blocking those Christine medium kicks. Goes for the side swap SPD. And the bear grab to finish it off. Catches everyone with that running bear grab. Round two. Yep. Professor yeah. is just getting taken to scoops well. You cannot jump at a Zangi oh, yeah. because we Nine times out of ten, they will be ready with that lariat or the, the credit card swipe or some kind of anti-air. It's just not worth the risk. Which button do I anti-air with? All three All of them. <laughs> <laughs> so what is uh, what can Professor do here? Uh, I mean, of... he's 
Yeah, He's playing more. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. 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 More fireballs until V triggers a thing, and then he can start to play with his feet. Yeah, just like. Yeah, that's <laughs> it. Yeah, like more of that. <laughs> Follow it up with the occasional uh, tiger upper. And then actually, and then after he's blocking. Oh I finished what I was going to say afterwards. Ooh. Unfortunate. Um, after he blocks the V skill 2, uh, he should stick out a limb and um, contest. But like a long limb, so it actually hits him. Otherwise, he's just gonna get scooped like that. Nice. I like the crush to empower the V skill. Got. Oh, nice. My rotor is just running away with it. Nice There's jump. a bit of a uh, no lack, lack of matchup knowledge the way that uh, seems like the person hasn't played this type of geek before, especially maybe not with this trigger, uh, this V skill. So he got he got hit a lot by that V skill too. Just pushing his buttons, getting the one hit of armor, and then um, hit into a into some hugs. Yeah. You think? You think that? All Sagat players would be like, yes, a geef, I can bully this man to... Turn him out. <clears throat> my heart's content, but... Yeah, Professor just... Isn't throwing the fireballs, not... Yeah, may maybe some so fast, heavy, high ones as well, so geef struggles to jump over them. Uh, my road is jumping a bit. Oh. Oh, unfortunate DP from Professor. Yeah, I don't agree with that activate. Uh, Professor has a habit of his raw activates. I think 99% of the time it's a raw activate. If not, was, uh, only because Zangief was in his face. Yeah, so what he would, that's where he would normally do his activate straight into his um, cannon, into the uh, Tiger Knee sort of setup. Ah. Um, and this is raw, it's all uh, unscaled, right? So yeah. it, it's kind of, that's his cut, that's it's Professor's comeback mechanic. But it can get him into trouble because if he doesn't give himself enough time, it's still going to uh, start up. Obviously. Yeah. Ooh, Kara Fireball, I like that. Yeah, Professor just doesn't have an answer to the V skill, it seems. V Crush. Oh, no conversion, no. Yeah, no follow up. CA. Nope. Oh, <laughs> jump CA. Oh, the empty jump CA. And my Rota will take it 3 0. Fairly good at the steamroll, wasn't it? Yeah. Did, yeah. did yeah. Professor get in around? I don't no, I think, think so. I, I think I the, v honest... skill, the V skill just tripped him up. I don't think he's come come up against that before. Didn't have an answer. Yeah. Just it's go time. Too, too many jump forwards at the Geef, just trying to test him on those anti airs, and he suffered for it. I mean, just no answer to that V skill. Just. Big, big rip for Professor, but Pyrota takes it, moves on to Grand Finals. So, where are we going now? To losers... Losers... Of course. So, yeah. Midnight and Dragnor. <laughs> Yay! Well, Rota, you can sit pretty for a while. We'll be back. We'll be back in the grand final. We have two more matches before we get back to that one. 
We haven't seen the other professor yet. <clears throat> Come on, come on, Dragnor, get in here. Okay, Morena, you're gonna have to be booted. Or. Go. Why am I unable to kick Broker? Uh, maybe Dizzy has to do it. No, there, there he is. <clears throat> All right, here we go. It's the first time we're watching Dragnor tonight. You, you know, he normally yep. can stream early, isn't he? Uh, where has he been? Oh, he's had a run through losers as well. Just like Midnight. Now, I know last night I said that I think Midnight would be my pick to win this week, but bias. I, I'm gonna have to <laughs> betray my earlier prediction because I didn't know Dragon was entering. And well, Chun's got to stick smart. together. Yeah, you just got your Chun glasses on, don't you? Yeah, Chun colored glasses. <laughs> the sickest with punish. Hey. Dragnor, you, sh you should EX legs after those fireballs. Don't, don't take the stand medium kick. Fireballs lightly, just EX legs. Oh, oh, listen to him. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Midnight takes the first round. Round two. Fight. Oh, that is unfortunate. That was a deep dive kick. Looking for the slide. Nope. Yeah, Dragnall's looking for some kind yeah. of activate. So that was a the slide there, he stopped yeah. it. Stopped it out. Oh, Chip. Yep, dead. Yep, that, that is unfortunate, but... Smart use of the chip out. From midnight. Akuma wins. You hate to see it. Is this meant to be three or two? Three. Okay. Round one. Unfortunate back, back for eyes. Uh, just clipped by the demon foot. Punish. Straight back into the corner. Barely even on the uh, life, but that's now given Midnight the lead. Minus two. Oh, uh -huh. that was. Oh, the carry on the V break. All right, midnight. Round two. Point. You know he's pretty Looking excited about that one. That was, that was coin. That was tight. I just want to see one ex legs on those stand medium kicks fireballs from Dragnor. That's slow. That's like minus on hit, isn't it? Yes, it's uh, very minus on here. So, if Chunts are doing that, 
without V trigger or it's a. Don't let them get away with it. Nice read! Uh, I always let them get away with that. I keep forgetting. I know it's minus, but I keep forgetting. Yeah, it, it happens a lot, and I feel bad every time I do get away with it because <laughs> it really shouldn't. Don't don't get don't get me wrong, I'll take those W's, but you know, I do feel a little bad inside. You know, midnight look looking very dominant against Dragnor. Fight! Interrupt. And he is. Good conversion on the counter hit, crash medium. Oh, unfortunate crash down. That is a dead Chun Li. Oh, he stuffed the jump, but that's okay. Oh, okay, so save resources. Close. Yeah. If you got that jump in, that probably would have killed him. He could have EX5 or 2 because the bat uh, the oh, outscale oh, that. him out of the demon. Teleport. That was dirty. Yeah. Round two. Oh, nice, nice Tatsu for the Kokon. Rush counter. EX. Oh, it, it's actually hurting me to not <laughs> see any of these EX legs. Oh. Oh, here we go, style time. Disgusting. Absolutely <laughs> disgusting. Classic Midnight, huh? Cool Steamroll. Pretty dominant showing. You hate to see it. And I, I, I am aware I may be alone in that opinion. <laughs> but god damn, that, that, that actually hurt to watch. So, the next game will actually be a rematch because Professor sent Midnight to losers. So, I wonder what's going to happen next. Let's get him back in here. Midnight wants that revenge. I think he's going to go Bison. Just, what, crush Professor's mental? Yep. That'd be, that'd be interesting. With the, the counter pick. That's first to three. You never know. He might. He might throw out. He might just stick because he's just, he's had a pretty good run. Maybe he just wasn't warmed up at the start, right? We don't know. So mm -hmm. he seems to be on a roll at the moment. Although, if he does want to play that that mental mental game, Bison would be an excellent character to do it with. Um, fell. Sorry. Uh, uh, we need to just step back. Yeah. Fight. 
Oh. I skip off me. No. It's just right back with his own. I can the XDP too. But Midnight keeping Professor in the corner. Should you reset? Big time. No. Presso is looking for something with those 10 heavy kicks. Oh, nice, nice off the cut. It's gonna be big for midnight. Nearly got demon on deck. Yeah, demon, not a threat. Poke will do it. Unlucky. Now yeah, stand light kick, just securing the round for Professor. Signs a lie. Side swap Tatsu puts Professor at risk at the corner. Stay in the corner. Yep. No jumping. What you jumping for, boy? Cool. That is a very dead Akuma. For sure. Just. <coughs> Sagat wins. Strong opening round from uh, Midnight, but Professor ends up taking game one. Hmm. The set could go the distance. Kumo does not have the uh, health to survive that type Fight. of uh, punishment. No. That was a missing put because of the V-Trigger yeah. threat, I'm pretty sure. That is gonna hurt! Oh, that is a lot of red. That Midnight flies back in with the projectile invisibility and throws it. Don't get David Flip. What was looking to be a dominant round from Midnight certainly looked a lot less dominant after that one, <laughs> one combo from Professor. All that damage. It could be wrong, but it looks like Professor's walking back during these uh, staggers and frame traps. If Knight catches on to that, he can always catch him with a um, with the crouching medium into a Tatsu crouching medium mm. kick. Jump in. I, look, I, I look to see chat and uh, pass is getting timed out. <laughs> so I, 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 me message, messages deleted by by a moderator, so I can only wonder what degenerate filth pass is about. It. Something with Batman that most likely. Yeah, maybe. Or Ramble Fall. Either way. Professor in the corner, throw. I think if Midnight holds Professor with the corner, he's eventually going to jump out. Like, and so I guess mm. jump was very, you know, easy one to punish. These rounds have all kind of started the same. Midnight comes out swinging and quickly gets Professor in the corner, and then just 
Yeah, Professor finds a way to nake his way out of a oh my tricky God, situation. Oh my God, Oh, that is it, big ouchies. That's just a nice health bar you have there, my dear friend. It would be a shame if I just took half of it right now. <laughs> You don't, all right, well, one all. Midnight gets one back. You don't, you don't need half of this. Let me just take it from <laughs> you real quick. Sasuino Helper. Midnight health bar. can get Professor <laughs> to the corner. He just has to wait it out. Professor's going to eventually try and jump out. And I think Midnight is just trying to continue a lot of that pressure. And maybe he doesn't need to with that big life lead. Um, just wait it out. Oh, nice, Edge, nice. Yeah. Look at that damage just from the one uppercut. Oh boy. Can't take many more of those. Nice walk under. I feel like he oh knew he was gonna do it, but he expected it earlier. Yeah. He's he did not. You see uh, the hesitation. Heads up for all everyone fighting Akumas. You do not want to be blocking the air fireballs crouching. It, the taller you are, you, you want that. You want the fireballs to be hitting you higher, just so Akuma is more punishable. If you're crouching there, it's harder to punish Akuma. Oh. This game is just pure aggression. <laughs> I think Midnight thought he was more plus there after the F5 balls, but as Jazz was saying, because of Cigar's height, it's not the case. But yes, yeah, good, nice, good slot. Barber knocker of a match. They just swinging. They be swinging. Oh, a character uh, swap, or, or is midnight just taking a counter, taking a breather? Maybe, maybe it's time for a counter pick. I would wager so. But you, you still. The only Betting on that bison? Yeah. But the only problem I have with this idea, assuming I'm correct, is the professor doesn't throw fireballs. <laughs> like, not as often as, like, your typical scat. So... When I, when I play him, he, that's all he does. So, <laughs> maybe, maybe he's uh, he adjusted a bit of his play style. Um, I've never played against professor and he's throwing tons of fireballs. It's always fighting with the feet. He does yeah, yeah, look, he does. He, 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 yeah, does he does prefer the feet. He definitely does. And, and look, I think sometimes you can catch him autopiloting. It just sort of goes through which buttons he wants to press. Um, so if you can kind of wait for those, there's a way to get in. But because of Sagat's reach, it's hard to actually get into punch some of those sometimes. I get lucky and I duck underneath. Oh, the bison. Whoever picked that, well done. Thank you. Um... <laughs> uh, but yeah, no. Look, let's let's see. Well, now depending on which fee skill Bison's got, I don't think he's going to be throwing that many fireballs. Fight. Fall up from the overhead, so Midnight gets to keep Professor in the corner. 
Block strings continuing. That's it. The frame trap classic Sam medium kick in a cannon. Yep. Round two. And Presso is one round away from double eliminating uh, Midnight from this tournament. That was cool. He timed the scissors after the stand medium kick. They looked like it cancelled. Oh, unlucky. Oh, uh, too early on the hell flames. Oh, back on Chrono, whatever it's called. Close enough. Nice. The blast is a tick tool. Midnight staying alive. A lot of ground to make up to take the set back. Good slide under. Oh, slides under the fireball. Midnight's trying to bait some DPs, but they're not coming yeah. out at the moment. Press on the corner, but not for long. Oh, and Presso and that, is going to take That's it. Midnight yeah. is out at loser's final. Professor will advance the grands and Sagat wins. Wait, is this a rematch for Professor yep. against my rider? Yeah, this is the this was the yeah. winners' final. So. He, he wants double, that revenge. Double Jeopardy. <laughs> double, double Jeopardy. Been had a great run through losers, but unfortunately, Sagat stopped him. It's go time. Unfortunately, should have went to Bison from the start, I think. Because like, he would have had more health to play with to kind of get a bead on Professor's like tendencies and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Alright, so... Who do we need to get back in here? Um... My Rota. Rota. Professor. Rota. Well, Professor just left. Yeah. James, well, come back. Uh, clearly... Professor has forfeited the tournament and My Rota <laughs> is the winner. <laughs> you don't want like, a gift to win, do you? I mean... No, but clearly... <laughs> Professor just forfeited. Like, how else am I meant to? Ah, oh, he's right there. How else am I meant to interpret it? This leaving the lobby when he's the only one left in the tournament, other than his he's opponent. Getting the, he's getting the player two side. That's the mix. It's planned, calculated, extrapolated. Let's do this. All right, let's see if um, Professor's learned some lessons. And if so, what could they be? Those rounds didn't go for very long last time. More fireballs. Um, yeah, yeah, if he's been listening. <laughs> More fireballs. It's no shame in playing lame when it's a grappler. Do what you got to do. Oh, here we go. We've got to oh, change him. Oh, okay. What the hell is this? So, Professor does have an Abigail. So, um, okay. pro probably his uh, secondary. Um, uh, professor saying he'll try oh, one yeah, match. So uh, I can't remember the last time I saw him. Abigail versus Keith. How did this work? Oh, he uh, can... Ooh, nice. Same as last time. <laughs> That's so goofy. Um, they can so the same as last. He's got the run to get through the, the uh... What am I thinking? I'm thinking of Cigar vs. Abigail. Don't listen to me. Oh, come on. It doesn't matter, it's looking like second verse, same as the first, and my rotor just steamrolls that first looking, round. Looking like a wash. 
character select, please. Last catch. Oh, catches the jump with the flip. I just didn't think that's, that grab's gonna connect, but it does. So much rage on that um, SPD. Oh boy, this is... Now... Oh no! <laughs> I was about to say, if my rotor wanted to be absolute Giga Chad there, but CA <laughs> with the V-Trigger charge up from Abigail, just... Absolute Hirosha. Just... Well, I guess any throw would work, because that's the only way that you can... You have to throw Abigail out of that, right? Before he starts, yeah, yes. otherwise it's like 99 hits or something, isn't it? Correct. Yeah. yeah. You can throw him out of the travel as well, yeah. but... Yes. Throw or just jump forward. It's go time. Over it. But yeah, it's nice. Nice CA eh? would have been absolute Giga Chad move. Giga Chad, I haven't heard that before. <laughs> You haven't heard of Giga Chad before? Never heard of Giga Chad. Look ah. it up. What <laughs> I'm probably showing my age here. Nah, it's like a... I'm pretty sure, like, the original guy is real, but, like, the picture itself, I don't think is real. But it's just, like, this really, really muscly dude, and he's got, like, the most it's chill eight. joy you've ever seen. <laughs> it's right, it's great. Right. <laughs> yeah, okay. Alright. That's pretty funny. Imagine if Dan had that jawline. <laughs> Looks so silly. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to take Dan seriously. <laughs> Not that I'm implying I do take Dan seriously, but, but like, even less. Round one. Fight. Professor trying to go low on that V skill. I'm pretty sure that doesn't work. Yeah, the armor is full body. The stand heavy punch you sweet. Yeah, you just got a neutral jump if you see. Um Geef's running bear grab at you from, from a distance. Neutral jump and punish them on, on your descent. Okay, I agree with that. Yeah. Oh, suck. V trigger activation, give him the big suck. Oh no, V shifts and still gets grabbed. Yep. Just, just neutral jump it and. Not getting his hit uh, as many times by the, the V score. Oh, pro Professor yeah. having a very clean round this time. There we go, let's go. Just adapt. Jumps. Unlucky. We hit yeah, it. There's. Ooh, no, not punished. Oh, no. Punish that it, could all, it could all come crumbling down. Okay. The anti air crash heavy punish. That was, that was interesting. Alrighty. Perso staying alive this game. I think that was a mistake. I think he was trying to do feed. Those low shots interrupting this 10 heavy punch. Oops. Body starter. Let's go. Nice, he jumped one, nice. Unfortunately, he back 
He back jumped it, so he couldn't really mm. punish it, but, you know, better than... Better than nothing, I guess. There we go, that's more like it. Fireball trap. DP, those jumps. Commanding, commanding round for Professor, and he ties it mm. up one game apiece. Just gotta do that five more times. Round one. Unfortunately, he's cornered himself. Ooh, nice neutral jump. Nice jump. Oh my god, the ball's on this man. He's just not... He's sick of geese shenanigans. Nice, kick to the head. Jump back, crush chowder. <laughs> Round two. Fight. Nice V-shift just to get the space for the fireballs. Roto tried to air SPD the jump back, but... Nah, he's gonna jump catch the too Yeah, too slow on that one. Professor's got this one figured out. Yep. Gotta stop making these mistakes. Yes. Maybe slow the fireballs down when Rota has V trigger available. Because those sucks are equalizing a lot of these life leads. Look at that. It's now looking like this matchup is how it's meant to go. There we go. Yes. Excellent ad the adaptations from Profe Sagat Professor. Professor. Jumps over the EX bed grab. You'll love to see it. One more. Then he gets the reset. Then he's got to do it all over again. Yeah, my rotor seems to be cracking a little bit. It just. I think his uh, gimmick is just not working anymore. He needs a new strategy, but um, he can't find a new one yet. Oh, there is the day. Party. Party has started. Just brave reversals for space, and now fireballs be chucked. Too early on that jump. Oh, too late on that jump, I should say. Nice quick punish. Unlucky. Oh, uh, oh, doesn't finish. Yeah. Round two. Ow, that was unfortunate, but. Immediately. Yeah, even against Geese, that was a lot of damage. My god. Oh, nice. The Cyclone actually missed. No, no fireballs counted that while it's active. I think you could have punished that normally. Maybe. Oop. Excellent. Yes. I think the last three rounds have ended that way, that Professor's won. 
Yeah, he's just not getting caught by those bear grabs anymore, and it's paying off huge for him. Yes. I'm sure Rhoda hates to see it right now, but this play from Professor is... Oh my god, the ball's on this man. Yeah, Mitra go on deck for my rotor, no suck. Uh, weird indirection, no follow up. Yeah, no, too early on that jump, still gets hit by the, the cyclone. And... I'm gonna do it again, three in a row. <laughs> and Professor... I think, I, to, I think he tried to take that, but Weird. just went back too early. Um, but yeah, good work Professor, it resets the bracket. We have pro finals now. After the reset, I don't think he's a hundred percent on the wake up DPS, but it's it's up there. It's up there. Sorry about that. I'll go into this reset. Professor looks to be keeping up his uh, fireball game, and my rotor gets a good jump in. Party started with bear grab. Professor not take, not wanting to take any more of those bear grabs. Keeping up with his back jumps. Professor in the corner. Oh, this could be. Oh, this is this is scary for Professor. Uh, nice. The EXT thing. <laughs> there was a time that was coming out. That's when it was coming out. Absolutely no fear. I think if my rotor could, you know, can keep an eye on um, Professor's uh, EX bar. He, he could start to figure out when these are coming because yeah. Professor's spending it, he's spending the bar. Ah, uh, he... Without hesitation, he is spending those bars on those DPs. Ooh. I tell you what, if he gets any more, I'm gonna have to start investing it. Just, just pay it off big time. For sure. Does that, if, when uh, Geef hits with that V skill too, will that always go into an SPD or...? Like on is, hit? Uh, on hit, because he's doing like he's doing a um a jab, a crouching jab, and I'm just wondering. Because I was walking it's, it's out. It's to catch. It's to catch people getting um, trying to take the turn back and they're whiffing. Okay. okay. So all these all professors got to do is stick out like stand medium kick or something. Or a crouch medium kick. Ooh. Apple with the fireball. Because the, the, the Vistas minus 4. 
Finish running and then get the jab. And... No, oh, it's old Daniel for me. Yeah, I knew that was and coming. That, that is <clears throat> dead. Absolute dead. My loader was waiting for that. Fight. He was waiting for that. Fight. Nice, it's TP. Keeping distance, I like that. Was All waiting. too late on that DP. I think because he did the, the heavy one. Yeah, it just came out a fraction too too late. Yeah. It's one way to break through the armor. One hit, right? One hit around. Jump, jump light. Yeah. Jump light. Kick into the eggs DP. That's read. Gets caught. Unfortunate. That's a lot of damage. Spin to win. Oh. Unfortunate. If he did a faster button, I think that would have worked. Yeah. Zangief win. Um, Zangief players in the chat would have to correct me, but there is a jumping headbutt move that Zangief does. That does like a shit ton of stun. After EXDPs, my rotor could be doing that for like mad damage and stun as a punish. Am I right? Or am I just imagining? imagining I, I, do, I do feel like there should be more of a punish you could be getting out of his DPs. It feels like that's a fairly basic um, combo that he's using. It's not a big damage one, but I don't know. Uh, I don't mm. know. Yeah, he's just doing like a headbutt. Light kick into Lariat. Yeah, Lariat. yeah, I just feel like there could be something bigger than that, right? <laughs> Feels like there should yeah, be. Might... Yeah, something like yeah, something like that. You know, a thrush maybe into something into an SPD. Surely it's gonna start with a crush counter. I heard some kind of X starter. Unlucky, but it's alright. My road has got his trigger. I don't think it's enough nah, to kill the fireball. Oh. The same mistake. Yep. At at that spacing, yeah, the fireball's a mistake. Nice. Did he finish it? Yeah, he will. Yeah, he's finishing it for sure. Probably didn't even need to spend the bar there. If I just. What? Nice, sending a message. <laughs> Round two. Fight. I think. In, I think. In this economy. I think after the cannon, you might have. After two cannons, I don't know if a normal knee would connect. Maybe you no. need to do it. Maybe. What about a DP? Uh, if you car yeah. it? Maybe? Yeah, yeah, if you car it. Yeah, yeah, sure. But I, mean, I, guess, I, I guess you don't want to risk it, right? Like you said. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think only the V skilled DP can reach, but I'm not, I'm not, I'm not sure. Oh, nice DP. Get to the corner. Nice. Alrighty. That's it ties it up. In this loser. Loser's reset. Ooh, more grand final reset rather. Yeah, okay, so consensus looks like after two cannons he needed to do the EX knee. Slowly walking back into the corner. Putting himself where Rider wants him in the corner. Yeah, he needs to, needs to just be jumping when he sees Rider doing the V skills. Like, just jump forward or a neutral jump, depending on spacing.
Uh, yeah, Sigurd has no multi-hitting normals, so the armor is just messing was, him up big. That was mm. the first uh, wall bounce. The only multi-hitting normal he has is stem heavy kick from close range. Yeah. Mm. I'm thinking gotta be standing for that anyway. Yeah, which at the ranges that my rotor is doing face skill. Ooh. Oh. That 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 was close, but Professor's just able to clutch out the EXDP to avoid the bear grab. A light DP would have worked there too, right? No, no light's an air immune for cigar. Oh okay, it's the wrong way, it's the other way around, is it? Yeah. So what's his throw immune one? Yeah. We're gonna assume it's medium. I okay. mean, yeah, Midnight, he can punish the V-Skill with a jump, instead of just... Well, raw tiger knee, into the face. <laughs> Final round. Fight. He could try to punish the V-Skill with a jump, but my rotor moves a lot after the V-Skill usually. Yeah, if he avoids... Avoids it without the punish due to the jump. That's a win done just taking these to the face. True. Yeah. My rotor is just v skilling him to death and it's paying huge dividends. My rotor's watching the bar a little bit. He knows that Professor can't. He, professor was waiting for the EXDP, but Professor had no bar to EXDP, so. I think if you can see that he can't do it, you just got to keep up the pressure. Because I don't think he uses DPs otherwise to get out of pressure. It's only the EX oh. DPs. Professor, you aren't just talking in chat while you're meant to be playing. Like that, that, that would be four <laughs> four. Don't be, don't be doing that. Round one. So, what have we got? Is this my rotor for the win now, I think? Yes. Yes. My rotor okay. wins one more. The DP keeping him away. Connection seems a little choppy in this game. This like game. But well, Professor, we're kind of perfect regardless. No suck. One more, don't throw it. Ooh, oh, that no, is no. unfortunate knee. Oh no. I think that was no. meant to be a SPD. For sure, but <laughs> Professor gets the back throw and looking to tie it up to the game's pace. We haven't seen many of those heavy punches, have we? Mm. No, he just hasn't needed to. Like, he's getting so much mileage out of his V skill. Yeah. Will the heavy punch absorb the fireball yeah. or not? No. No idea, but... Faso not punishing the sweep after the, the jump in. And the problem with Professor doing the, the jump light kick into EXDP on lane for the beast skill is now he just doesn't have it on for wake up situations. Uh, dead youth. Is that three games? No, no it's two two. Two, two. Two, two. Okay. I'm tripping. Round this one. Fight. Right, this one. This game's for the tournament. Yeah. 
I've got to say, I really uh, liked how our Professor has adapted um, to the situation. For sure. Um, but it's just... Just making a few mistakes that are letting him down. He could have taken it already. But my road are looking to finish this up dominantly. Let's back throw. Alright, at the spacing he's got to be careful of uh, fireballs. Oh, yeah, after one you can do a break the day. Only my road is waiting for the activate. Oh no, too far away. Yeah, too away for, for the suck, but... Alright, got him. Rip. Yep. One round away. All the Ooh. yeah, my rotor knows you've got Professor afraid. Just look at all this, all this V skill. Too late on that V trigger activation, still gets the kick to the face. And that will take it. Bad, bad target cannon, and my rotor just pops his V trigger. Really good effort, though. I've, as I said, I was impressed with how he adapted and uh, nearly brought it back on the cusp. Yeah, he did. Got, he, he got that reset, which is a huge improvement from winners' finals performance. Mm, 100%. Excellent work. Right. And congrats oh. to my rotor. That was a that was a very good run with Geef. Mm. Got a lot of mileage out of that B skill too. <laughs> I think some people need to go and lab that how to get out of it. That is, yeah. That was a lot of mileage out of that B skill too. Oh. Guess we get a wrap. Guess we well, better wrap this up. Yeah, well, I'll um, I'll take us out. So that concludes another Fledgling Fighters EX. What was this one? 180. 180. 180. Wow. Uh, thanks for everyone for watching, tuning in. Congrats to our top three, which were uh, third place was I think mid was midnight. Yeah. Uh, Professor in second and my rotor uh, taking it out. Um, Next week we'll have a regular fledglings, which is a tournament for under platinums. If you're interested, please sign up via the Discord. Um, I've been with Jazza and Fel. Uh, thanks for joining uh, joining me on comms, and thanks for everyone for tuning in. No problem. Right, man. All right. See you all yeah, next everyone. week. Good night. See ya.